people with one direction Put us to the test We gonna build and build and build and build Till we make St. Lucia the best I must say that we, we have a very good team of cabinet members. We have very open and frank discussions. Um, when we disagree on something, everyone is free to express themselves as they see fit. So it's a very cordial atmosphere within the cabinet. Even when there's disagreement, um, we get along. The camaraderie among um, the cabinet is very good. And that augurs well for our relationship because we can interact with each other at different levels. So it's really a wonderful experience working with my cabinet colleagues, um, though we disagree on things at times. But, but generally speaking, um, what comes out the strongest in our discussions is that the priorities of the country comes first. And, and that is very refreshing. Unlike what you may hear out there and the perceptions that are out there, every time a decision is to be made, we consider the impact on St. Lucia and how it is going to benefit St. Lucians in the long term. I must say that the Prime Minister has a lot of energy, he has a lot of drive, and he has great plans and ideas. Um, working with Prime Minister Chastney he is very encouraging um, he thinks outside of the box. It is difficult at this point in time to focus on all of the achievements of the government and the reduction of VAT by 2.5% um, and the overall positive impact on the economy, being able to grow the economy. And you would observe that the opposition is not even tackling the economy. They, they are sidelining to other issues. I inherited the ministry with um, most of the DVRP projects, the Disaster Vulnerability Reduction Project, um, lagging behind in terms of implementation. And, and within the first few months in office, when the World Bank carried out their first assessment, it indicated that we were far behind in terms of implementation. We have seen um, the last report from the the World Bank on DVRP indicated improvements. I, I want it to be excellent by, by the next um, assessment. One of the flagship projects is the completion of the Bexon Park, which had been, um, that's the Sun Valley Park along the Bexon Highway. This project stayed um, incomplete, remained incomplete for the five years of labor in office with very little work to be completed, but they deliberately did not finish the project. So that was one of the first projects we were able to complete coming into government. The Sarot Multipurpose Court and Community Center, same situation. While the other government, um, the Labor Party government, focus on taxing the people, <clears throat> this, this UWP administration is of the view that you, you should create an enabling environment to allow businesses to do well. And, and the reduction in taxes, the incentive packages that are being offered, and all of the decisions of the government to boost economic activity is, is the indication. We are a government of workers because it is evident that in two years, we have done more than what Labour Party did in five years. And I challenge anybody on this measure our works in two years against what the Labour Party was able to accomplish in five years. And you would see that we are by far these better workers than the Labour Party have ever been. As one people with one direction, put us to test. We're gonna build and build and build and build till we make St. Lucia the best.